Welcome back to East Texas Live, the 11 o'clock edition. Come back for the 3 o'clock edition. A new wave of energy is shaking up the tech industry. Joining us live on East Texas Live is Jay Jane Yu and James Walker with Nano Nuclear Technology to tell us all about it. Jay, James, what's going on with Nano Nuclear? What are you guys doing over there? Hey, nice to meet you, James. Uh, Nano Nuclear is a uh, emerging microreactor company creating carbon-free energy solutions for the future. Uh, think of a nuclear battery on a truck that will democratize energy for remote locations, mining operations, natural disasters, military uh, deployment. Um, the, the use is endless. Yeah, it's a miniature power plant here. So, but why nuclear? Why is nuclear the energy source you guys chose? <clears throat> well, we didn't actually start with nuclear. Um, we wanted to get into the energy space and we actually examined everything. But actually, when you're objective about it, we, uh, we looked at other renewables like wind and solar and we realized actually that these were potentially enormously expensive um, inconsistent energy sources and that they weren't actually a solution to the, the market we wanted to address. Like, if you want to power remote mines or remote locations or disaster relief areas or anywhere like that, you couldn't provide the consistent energy that these areas need. Um, and so nuclear was the solution. And then we realized that actually the smallest possible nuclear was the solution. And the best way to transport it was to put it on the back of a truck and be able to ship it anywhere you want. Um, that way you have consistent power and it's clean and you can tr and you can replace even diesel generators if you want. So tell me how this new technology is going to fit into the larger climate change discussion. I noticed y'all were pointing out at the beginning this is a carbon free energy source so that might raise some eyebrows. Yeah, um, carbon free energy. Right now, there's a big shift in, in many governments around the world. They have a lot of net zero goals. And without nuclear, you're not going to be able to reach those goals. Um, you, you know, people are looking for green energy technologies, climate tech. Um, you know, there's there's a energy crisis around the world in Texas. Even I think I just read that prices have gone up thousands of a percentage uh, so texas right now is is having an issue also government governor abbott has mentioned you know that he wants to expand nuclear in texas too and you know not just have it be a um a fossil fuel state that's been uh, well known throughout history well, I'm glad y'all are working on this because it seems a technology that's inevitable. We had nuclear power aircraft carriers. We've had nuclear powered subs. I figured eventually you get to a smaller. Sounds like what you guys are working on. I want to go to the next level. When can I get a nuclear powered car? <clears throat> yeah, that's the thing. It, it is inevitable. And um, I don't think there's any way around it. I mean, uh, one of our modelers here call it Tina. There, there is no other solution. And so, you know, if you even for things big shipping vessels they use enormously polluting bunker fuel um, if you want to replace those actually the US uh, Navy has been moving um, aircraft carriers submarines around the world with nuclear reactors for decades without incident cleanly with zero emissions if you want charging stations for vehicles around the country nuclear is the solution there um, it, it, it is an inevitable that nuclear is going to have to be a, a, an increasing composition of the energy infrastructure of the country uh, and, you know, Texas included. It's a big state. If you want to link it up, nuclear is the way to do it. Oh, I agree a thousand percent. I'm a big fan of what you guys are doing. Glad to have you on the show. So thank you, Jay and James. I look forward to bigger and better things coming out of nanonuclear in the future. Go to nanonuclear.com. If you have more questions, you want to find out more about what Jay and James were telling you about here, nanonuclear.com. Dot yeah, com. check out our social media handles and follow us. Um, we post a lot of things daily. All right. Hey, I, I, no joke. I'm a big fan of nuclear. I'll go do that right after the show.